Today we are doing something really special which is paragliding. Now this is an activity that is hugely popular in Switzerland and every time when people come to Interlaken they will think of paragliding. So today I will be showing you how the whole flight experience is like and what you should expect from the flight and so stay tuned and let's find out more. So this is the shop where we are doing our paragliding, it's called Paragliding Interlaken. You can find it just from the train station at Interlaken Oz, just walk straight and you'll come to this corner. So this is the car that will set off and bring you to the paragliding location which is at Bietenberg. So excited! We're at LHK at Fisher Alps. You can click the link here if you would like to see how paragliding is like. But now we're doing it in Interlaken. So the place that we are going to paraglide from is called Vietnamburg. It's like a hill, uh, the mountain that is not far away from Interlaken. And in terms of the cost of the paragliding, it's 170 francs for the flight itself. And if you were to want additional photos or videos taken from the flight, you will pay an additional 40 francs for the package, for the photo package. So that would be about 210 for the whole paragliding experience. Getting ready, everyone is setting off with their equipment and before you set off, you have to run down this slope like really fast so that the wind can catch and then you can set off here. Yeah, the five out of five, you so the pilots really are all just setting shoot. up and making sure Crazy. that the yeah. balloon, <laughs> whatever it's called, is big enough and then we have good wind so that we can head down. So Vince is setting off before me. He's getting ready. Are you ready?
grass field where you will land. It's the big, big grass field that you will find right in front of the Hotel Victoria. And it's also next to the restaurant Footers. You can't miss this spot. So just sharing a bit in terms of the equipment and what you can do or you cannot do on the flight. So you cannot take photos on the flight because it's dangerous. So you won't be allowed to do so. But don't worry because they have um, their GoPros and they take really good shots already. So you have photos and videos. And at the end of your flight, they will actually connect the device right directly onto your phone. And you have all of the photos and videos that were shot directly onto your phone. So I think it's really, really simple and easy and yeah after our paragliding session we headed for a chocolate making workshop at funky chocolate club during this one and a half hour workshop you will learn everything about chocolate making from its origins to identifying and understanding the different tastes that chocolate may have you will also get the chance to make your very own chocolate masterpieces while learning techniques for tempering melting and filling the chocolate mold and for the entire time, you get to eat as much chocolate as you like. So we're starting with the tempering and first we're gonna get the melted chocolate into our bowl. You need to mix it all well together. You will definitely need to create this one direction mixing, this one direction stirring in the bowl. This one will slowly and gradually melt the solid chocolates down. And this is how we cool down the temperature of warm chocolate. Smooth and shiny. Smooth and shiny. Just gotta wait for it to set into the mold and then we can have it. Wow, look at the one by Vince, it's so nice. This is Switzerland flag. I don't know what it is, but lots of pistache because he likes it. And then it's a nice foil design. Can't wait to eat it! Once you finish, you will have a nice certificate where you can certify that you finished the chocolate making workshop. So that marks the end of our itinerary here in Yongfrau and it's Lakan. I really hope that you enjoyed this special episode. Let me know what was your favorite activities in the comment section and make sure you follow us for the next Grand Tour of Switzerland. Bye!